Hey y'all, so I am still getting used to frontals. I am a glueless girl, all my wigs are glueless. I am up and going all the time, so I really don't always have the time to sit down and do a frontal. However, when I do, this is usually what it looks like. So I've already cut my lace a while ago, and this is actually my second install. And I'm noticing that there's some things that I would like differently compared to the first time I wore it. I want the hairline to really mimic my natural hairline so I'm actually cutting off the extra lace there and I'm doing like a zigzag method to just slightly make it uneven so it looks more natural. You guys, this all takes practice. I am a professional wig maker but I never really have time to wear these type of wigs because of my lifestyle. and kids and <laughs> being a mom I have to run out the door all the time so right now I'm really liking how this is looking it looks a lot closer to my natural hairline it's not going straight across and I'm just using the even spray and a mascara brush again I am in a hotel room with very minimal materials um, and I'm using that to press down my lace I really don't like using my hands to press my lace down and then after I'm gonna go in with my melt band my pastiche melt band leave it on for about 15 minutes take it off see how I feel now I want baby hairs well so now we're gonna go ahead <laughs> we're gonna trim some baby hairs and you call them baby hairs you call them adult hairs you call them short hairs whatever you want to call them stick with that but that's what I'm doing and I did not have edge control or any gel and I'm literally using conditioner from the hotel y'all I actually really liked it because after it dried my hair my baby hairs were really fluffy and so soft um, of course I'm not using a latex adhesive I'm using a temporary adhesive so if I sweat any water it's gonna easily lift it so it's important to use that melt band to hold it in place you have to be very patient when you want to use a frontal but not use an actual latex glue so now I went ahead and trimmed my baby hairs and I'm adding my melt band again and I'm gonna leave it on there for a couple minutes and then I'm gonna take it off and show you guys the outcome so this is how it looked after I had my melt band on you can see it looks really melted into my skin it looks in my opinion pretty natural obviously I don't have baby hairs like this obviously I don't have this hair texture but it's a look it's a vibe and it's giving and I really like it so let me know your thoughts in the comments any tips advice you have for me please share help a sister out